Are we seeing at least a beginning of a tapering of redemptions out of ULIPS? Uh, yes, so we can say the intensity or you know is lower. Uh, so last year we had huge redemptions. This year it is uh, the intensity has reduced, but not to say that it is reduced very significantly. But yes, the intense intensity does has reduced. Clearly, the fact that the you know investor has seen a twenty thousand market after such a long time is also prompting him to redeem both from mutual funds and insurance because he's seen that return after a long time. So I guess that itself that is also you know one of the reasons why you know the redemptions are happening, and clearly you know. We hope that going forward, if the market picks up momentum, then you could see that redemption pace reducing. Hmm. But what you're saying is that the kind of pillar or the biggest mobilizer of equity that insurance had come to become, that is not going to happen in a hurry. Yeah, I don't see that happening. The reason being that uh, uh, ULIPS as a asset class will take some time to pick up. Hmm. I don't see that happening in the immediate future. It could take some time. Because as of now, the mix of the insurance industry is more skewed in favor of traditional funds. However, uh, as if the markets pick up and the economy gains momentum, as I said, and people are actually able to see returns on their ULIPS, mm. then I see the ULIPS sales picking up and picking up very strongly. But that may happen maybe post elections next year because you know we still have an election coming up next year, and if, even if markets pick up by the end of this year, probably that pick up ULIP will come. With a lag, you know, people need to be convinced that they have earned some return before they start thinking of investing again, hmm. right? And before they, you know, so I think it is going to take some time. I don't see this happening immediately the next one year or so.